Hello seven, welcome back to my channel. So as you can tell by the title of this video, today I'm gonna to be reacting to some German folk slash Schlager music, which is um, described as really popular music that has really catchy tunes to it. And I got this idea just talking um, to some friends from work and they were talking about this type of music. So I thought it would be fun to react to this. I really like American country music and this kind of seems to be like the equivalent to American country music just based on what I've heard about it. And I know it's a bit of a controversial genre, especially amongst uh, the younger generation. So like millennials really hate this kind of music and it's much more popular with the older crowd. So let's see what I think of it. I am kind of nervous about this just because I did do a video before reacting to German rap music. I reacted with that uh, with my boyfriend and it was a very very controversial video so if you haven't seen that I will leave it linked down below but I'm gonna go for it you guys I'm gonna be honest I'm gonna tell you what I think I'm not here to sugarcoat things I'm talking about my experiences on this channel so let's see what this German country music is like it's actually kind of hard to find um, some newer music especially from male singers there seems to be a lot of newer music from females, but it was really hard to find males. So I have two girls and one guy here and they seem to be pretty popular. So hopefully I did get this right. Um, so let's get started. The first one that I'm gonna react to is um, a song by Andrea Berg. And the song is called Ja Ich Will, so yeah, I do. Let's go ahead and see what it's all about. And I wonder if my neighbors are gonna hate me after this because I'm going to be playing it kind of loud. All right, guys, here we go. So I really like the mood of the video so far. It's like theater setting. Okay, is it bad that I kind of like this? She's definitely a bit older. Uh, but she's giving me like Shania Twain vibes. You know, I gotta bring up Shania Twain as a Canadian. Oh yeah, Shania Twain vibes with the hat. Yes, that that outfit for sure. The white outfit with the hat. Guys, I like this. Oh my god, don't unsubscribe, I actually like it. But I am living for that white outfit, yes. I could picture myself wearing these types of outfits when I'm older. It's very like classy, but still very boss. I'm so cool, guys. <laughs> As I lose all of my subscribers. <laughs> I know it's coming, it's coming. The drop. Oh yeah, confetti everywhere. Woo. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah, the wink at the end. Oh yeah, <laughs> I like this. I can picture myself dancing to this in like a dive bar somewhere with like the older crowd and just, yeah, yeah, I'm totally down for this, so. Good for you, girl. I'm gonna give you a thumbs up for this one. I really like it. She just got a like from me. Um, the next one is by Peter Maffei and it's called Hallelujah. Um, so it was really hard to find newer songs, like I said, from guys that sing this type of music. Um, so this one's actually a couple of years old, but it does have 2.5 million views. Um, so I'm guessing it's kind of popular. It was popular at the time. So let's see what it's all about. So it's very scenic, a very dark mood. This guy seems pretty cool. Okay, definitely older. And I'm getting some Eric Church vibes. If you guys listen to American country music, he's like the badass older guy. That's like exactly this kind of vibe that I'm getting from him. Oh, it's getting political though. Hmm, 
I didn't expect that. Well, it is called Hallelujah, but I didn't expect it to be political in any way. Okay, so he's it's showing clips of like a third world country and I guess different types of family across the world. So this definitely has a deeper message and I wish I knew what he was saying because, you know, I'm interested. As far as the song goes, it's very peaceful. I don't know if it's something I would personally listen to, but maybe if I'm like in a crying mood, you know, feeling a little down and I just want to listen to some sad music, this might be the thing. He seemed like a really cool guy, like really cool style with the earring, you know, the leather jacket riding his motorcycle. Seems like a cool grandpa. This is my lighter, I don't have one, but if I did. This seems to be my dance move for everything. I promise you I have better dance moves, but right now I'm in the waving my arms kind of mood. All right, so that was definitely a bit of a sadder song, more emotional. I think it has a deeper message just based on the clips. Like I said, I wish I knew what he was saying. Um, again, not something I would listen to myself, um, but it was interesting. I don't hate it. I don't hate it at all. Um, and Peter seems like a really chill guy. Um, you know, I like him. And now let's go over to what I think will be probably the most controversial based on the conversations that I had. Um, this is Helene Fischer. You guys from Germany probably don't need an introduction to her. She is a huge folk, schlager music, or musician I should say. Um, and she seems to be pretty controversial because I don't think a lot of people like her music. I don't know what it is, correct me if I'm wrong but I just had to listen to her and give my opinion. And the song that I've picked is uh, Achterbahn, which I believe means roller coaster. So I think this is gonna get emotional too. Here we go. Oof, starting off with that pose. Oh, I think I'm gonna like this. She's very pretty. Side note, I wish I looked cute with a little bun like this. It just doesn't work on me. Since we're going by vibes and making comparisons to American music, she reminds me of a cross between like a Britney Spears and a Carrie Underwood. So the dancing's kind of cool actually. Some half naked men, some badass girls dancing. Oh yeah, here's the poppy part. Alright, so that's her. I don't hate her. She's very poppy. I could see how she would be very popular here. Um, not something I would listen to. I mean, it's good for like a little dance break here and there. In terms of video, I would have to go with like Andrea or Peter. Um, they had like much better videos. Um, I don't know why you guys hate her. Maybe because she's like a bit cookie cutter, like very poppy, um, typical kind of singer. I don't know. You guys let me know below. Uh, but yeah, I don't think she's that bad. Um, that was my first Helen Fisher experience. Maybe I'll watch some other ones later on to see what I think. Uh, but that pretty much concludes today's video, guys. I'm gonna say that actually my favorite songs are in order of how I watch them. So the Andrea Berg song, then uh, Peter Maffei and then Helene Fisher was my least favorite one, but I don't think they're completely horrible. Um, but yeah, that's just my opinion. I really enjoy country music and poppy music and rap as well. So I'm kind of a mix of everything. So maybe that's why I like these ones a bit more. But you guys let me know down below if there are any other songs that you want me to react to or that you think I should check out. Please let me know as well down below in the comments. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video and found it fun. And if you haven't already, please don't forget to subscribe. And of course, I will see you guys all in my next one. Cheers.